So we've got a LiPo battery, cell number one is knackered, so I assume follow the black lead onto the back of there, it says, eventually, 1S. So I assume that's cell number one. So I need to move those wires to there, that wire to there. No, those wires to there, that wire, yeah, to there. Yeah, and then the red wire has wires out of it. That's right. I've never done this before, so this is new to me. So basically everything's gonna move along one. Just get rid of the red wire. Hey, hope it works. So that's cell number one desoldered, unsoldered. So let's move the wires. So negative off, negative balance lead off, moved over to cell number, new cell number one. Cell number two wire is now going to go on cell number three and then you yeah, disconnect the red. So we've got the negatives done, we've got the white lead moved over. That lead is going to go on to there with the live. So this red lead is going to be dead. So yeah, just moved all of the wires over one. And there's the old dead pack there, just going to cut the tab off shortly. There we go, all wires moved over one. Dead pack I've snipped out, so when I cut the dead pack, I thought, oh hang on, that's going to be live, so if I go in with a pair of scissors, I might touch that one and the negative together. So I bent the live out, that was sat there, scissors straight through, one dead pack. Um, let's pop it on the tester and have a look. So it's now coming up with two cell, 405, 404, perfect. There we go. We'll ditch that. We'll put insulating tape over these connectors, tape it all together, make sure it's nice and secure. I thought I'd show how I'm covering these terminals, just a bit of insulation tape from there, over the top, do the same on that one, gonna do the same on that one, but obviously that one's gonna clamp the two packs together and then wrap them around the other way. Probably with gaffer tape. There we go. I kind of figured I should caveat this video. Don't try this at home. You might burn your house down. You might blow something up. I only done it because I'm an idiot, so do it at your own risk, but don't blame me.